sports are universal. They have the ability to motivate and inspire unique excitement. Over the past year, time and time again, Pope Francis has highlighted the spiritual side of athletics. È bello quando in parrocchia c'è il gruppo sportivo. E se non c'è un gruppo sportivo in parrocchia, manca qualcosa. Eh? Se non c'è gruppo, manca qualcosa. And sports are also part of the Vatican. In 2013, its cricket team was born. It's not that popular in Europe, but it's very popular in Asia. Now sports and religion are joining forces for a good cause. In the month of September, the Vatican's cricket team will play against its Anglican counterpart. It is a way to promote ecumenism through sports by highlighting the common roots between the Church of Rome and the Church of England. Along with the Archbishop of Canterbury, we agreed that all proceeds will promote projects we both working like fighting against human trafficking and modern slavery. Before this match, the Vatican will have two other games. One against a team of journalists and the other against the British royal household, which represents Queen Elizabeth. The Vatican's team includes priests and seminarians studying in Rome. It's not an official league, but the team plays friendly matches. Several English teams that visit Italy have asked to play a friendly game against our team. We welcome it and hope it continues. In the future, once the Vatican team is more established, it hopes to play against other teams of different religions. It's a basic and friendly way to promote interreligious dialogue, where the starting rule is simply to have fun and play fair.